Hi, my name's Nikki. I'm a physiotherapist and I'd like to share with you three key tips that can help you if you have hip pain, if you've been sitting for a long time. Now it's really common if you've got osteoarthritis of the hip and even if you've been diagnosed with trochanteric bursitis or gluteal tendinopathy, that getting out of a chair after being sitting for a while sometimes can give you some pain, which means you limp for the first few steps. And I'm sure uh, if that's you, you can recognize that. So the couple of tips that you can try. Uh, the first thing is try to make sure that your hips are elevated. So your hips are a little higher than your knees. A wedge cushion is a great way of doing that. If you don't have access to a wedge cushion, then simply a thick folded towel at the back of your chair can sometimes help. The next thing, and this is probably more relevant to the vertically challenged people out there, is to keep your feet flat on the floor. If you come up onto your toes and you're sitting at work or in a chair up onto the tippy toes and you do that repeatedly or out of that habit if you can, crossing your legs simply stretches that outside hip tendon over the bone which makes it very uncomfortable by the time you go to stand up. It also creates more compression through the hip joint. So elevate your hips. Keep your feet flat and relaxed on the floor and don't cross your legs. There are three key tips to help you with hip pain.